So today I'm going to be doing a video with Zaffle. I did, I think, a clothing haul and stuff from them. But this one is just bikinis only. Obviously it's summer, so it's the time for just bikinis. But, I mean, if you're in a hot country, not England. I thought I'd share it with you. I've seen a lot of these actually and I was kind of sceptical to do it. But I found some really nice bikinis, so I thought I'd share. And obviously they're really affordable. Some of them are absolute fails, but... Yeah, all the information to every bikini and every item that I show will be down below. Zaffle is a brand, they're an Asian brand, so their sizes are really weird. Well, not weird, they're just, you know, they come up really, really small. I ordered a medium in everything, which I think they say is usually around a size 8. But it's kind of difficult, because whenever I buy bikinis, my top half is bigger than my bottom, kind of. I like to get bigger top sizes that fit me up top. And on my bottoms, I like to get a smaller size so it's not big bikini bottoms. You know when you see those people that have big bikini bottoms and they like sag on their bum? I have done a different kind of video. I filmed little clips on my vlog camera of me in some of the bikinis, some of the ones that I can show. I haven't done like a whole body shot because I don't want to put my body out to thousands of people. I'm not that comfortable um, showing my body at the moment. So let's just jump right into it. First bikini that I saw online and wanted to get immediately was this style of bikini. It's underwired and it's got this curved bit in the middle that kind of sits, you know, underneath. This is really awkward. I've seen a lot of these on Instagram. The shape looks really, really cool and I've never seen anything like it. This did not fit very well, it wasn't very flattering. These bits are way too small for my chest anyway. However, the one thing I do love about this bikini is the bottoms, and I'm going to be using the bottoms, like, m mix and matching it with other bikinis I have. But these are the bottoms, and as you can see, they're a bit of a weird shape. They've got kind of this dip at the top on both front and back, and they're very, very thin. So they are like a thong-style bikini, and they're just so comfy. They're thick on the sides, which means that they don't dig into your sides when you wear them. That's the one thing I hate about bikinis that just... Like have really thin straps and dig. It's not comfortable and it doesn't look great. And I actually picked up this bikini in this grey blue colour as well. And I really like this one. I saw a lot of these colours on Instagram actually. Again, the bottoms are amazing. Um, I really, really love the bottoms. I got everything in a medium. Really weird. They all fit differently. The bottoms usually are huge. Like the medium bottoms are huge. For size 8s, so they're definitely not. I'd say they're more almost like a 10. And some of them are at 12, they're just ridiculous, but I, I love this, these two bikinis, not for really these, the top parts, but the bottoms. I will probably wear them, but they're not one that you can really do much in, because I'd, I'd feel like you just, you know, fall out. Um, I did show this one in a clip, it's just this crop style bikini um, with thinner straps at the back, and it has a knot in the front. I got this in a khaki, and I also picked it up in a white, which I thought was really nice. This is the first top. Um, it's a khaki set, and it's just got the knot at the front. It's just kind of like a crop style bikini. Um, I really like this one. I think it fits really well. I feel really comfortable in, in it, so yeah. These both fit amazing. They're one of the bikinis that... Um, I feel really comfortable in. Because they're over the head, I don't feel like it would ever unclip and, you know, everything would fall out. Yeah, I really, really like these. The only criticism I do have is that the knots are pathetic. Like, <laughs> they're so tiny. I, I want, like, so much more material, but whatever. They're still really nice bikini and really affordable, I believe. The bottoms that they come with are, aren't my favourite bottoms. I don't usually like tie side bottoms. Um, again, they're really small, so they are a thong. Most of these are a thong style bikini anyway, um, but they do have the tie sides and the strings are pretty long. These are good um, if you like to have tie side bikinis. <laughs> Obviously. You can change the size of them on the side if that makes sense. So you can have them tighter or looser depending on how you want them to fit, whether you want them high up your leg or on your hips. Um, so, yeah, I got that in a khaki and a white. The next bikini that I got um, is this one. Um, this is a bandeau style bikini. I picked this one up in white and it's kind of this ribbed effect. I do say this in the clip, but it's big. It's huge. Um, it fits me. I don't want to say a bigger upper body, but I do have 
bigger boobs essentially and it fits really comfortable and I think um, these types of bikinis are really good for the beach when you don't want you know tan marks of straps or anything um, so I really really like this bikini actually just the bandeau top and um, high-waisted bottoms this have kind of had a rib effect it's quite it's quite nice I'm I feel really comfortable in this just know that it is a lot bigger to what other mediums are I think that's just gonna be a running theme though the, the um, sizing is not it's not great on these bikinis but um, obviously I didn't show the bottoms in the clip however these bottoms are ridiculous I don't know if you can see like how ridiculous these are like how long is that these are meant to be high-waisted bottoms and they fit like high-waisted bottoms but I just never really wear these style bottoms um, because they're the ones that kind of cut up yeah they show a lot um, they're very very high and they're just more of like an Instagrammable bottom I think I wouldn't ever want to wear these because I just feel really like self-conscious I think I don't know the next one is this um, black bikini it's actually come undone at the back which is another thing that I should probably mention that the clasps are a bit the bikinis that have clasps at the back are a bit dodge like they don't really <laughs> the tightness of it is holding it together as soon as it gets loose it will just fall off so that kind of makes me a bit nervous this next one is very small and tight as you can see it is a medium but again the sizings are just weird um, I really like it though it fits really well I feel really comfortable in it I don't feel like anything's gonna show which is good as you can see here like the inside is white and the inside of the bottoms are white as well the edges of the bikini curl down so you can see the white and it just looks really like it's not well made basically this one is kind of like a sports bra almost like crop top style bikini and I, and I really like these they're really good if you're doing like activities on the beach going in the sea going to water park something like that you feel pretty comfortable in them um, and I do really like this one it is very tight so it does kind of push up the boobs this video is going to be a bit of a weird one just talking about boobs it kind of gives you a push-up effect which is good um it has pads in it you can remove the pads a lot of these bikinis you can remove the pads which is good the only downside about this bikini which is such a shame because i think i would really love these bottoms although they are again quite high <laughs> which i don't know why like it's just a weird one as you can see it's black on the outside which is what it's meant to be but it's bright white on the inside and the way that these are, they're just not really finished off or made very well. And the white kind of, when they're sitting like that, you can see the white like curl over the top and it just doesn't look good. Like it, the finish just doesn't look good on this bikini because I want it to be all black, but it's kind of mixed in with a bit of white. So this next one is the only um, swimsuit that I got in this haul. Um, and I really, really like the style of this swimsuit. I think it's really nice i was looking on their website and i found it kind of hard to pick a swimsuit because a lot of them were just really like revealing and all about like side boob or under boob and i wasn't about i just really wanted a good fitting swimming costume it looked nice because when i do wear swimming costumes i love them i think they're so nice so i picked up this one um it's like this mustardy color and it's got this knot at the front with the keyhole that sits just underneath you you'll see it in the clip that i show like, this really nice um, mustardy colour costume. The fit is just pretty poorly made. As you can see, like the belly is so baggy. And um, on the sides here, it's a li little bit baggy and just doesn't really fit very comfortably. I feel like the straps are just gonna fall off my shoulders, which is really weird. I just wish it was tight like this on my body instead of baggy and just looks a bit ill-fitting. And I love it. It's, it's a really, really nice swimsuit and fits okay, but, um, yeah you'll see it's just a little bit baggy in areas and I just wish that it was made a little bit better because it would be a really nice swimsuit. This was maybe around like $12 or something so it's ridiculously cheap um, and it also comes with pads in the boobs which I thought was pretty good. I just wish that it fit a little bit better. Sticking with the yellow theme because apparently I just went crazy in this in this haul is this one which is very very similar to the swimsuit which is why I picked this one up it's basically kind of a bikini version of it again has the little keyhole and the ties the same kind of ribbed effect um, and the mustard yellow love it it's a nice bikini but it's just really small this one fits pretty badly again it's medium but it's so tight i like that there's a little keyhole bit here um but again it doesn't really match up to what i think it should be and the tie's nice 
the colour's good, but I'm not too sure on the fit, it's very tight. I mean, there's not much there, is there, like, to cover the whole boob. You'll see it tried on, but I, I do really like it. Um, I think it looks nice, but yeah, just again, pretty small. Bottoms for these I really don't like, which is a shame because I really love the colour and I really wanted to like them. These are a medium and they're so small, like, they're really tight, they have no stretch, like, in the top and a really thin strap and it just digs, just digs into your side and just does not look good at all. Yeah, they put your body into all different kind of shapes, so I'm not keen on the bottoms, which is a shame. The next bikini that I picked up, I just picked up this triangle bikini, this red colour, it's so nice, like I don't, I didn't own any red bikinis before, but I've seen a lot of people wear red bikinis recently. Kourtney Kardashian wore a triangle red bikini and she looked so good. Um, obviously I'm not going to look anything like her, but I'll give it a go. I just really like it, it's a basic triangle bikini, fits really well. This one doesn't actually have a clasp, it's just an over the head bikini, which I like. I, I then don't feel like I'm going to, you know, suddenly fall out. This next one um, is a red bikini again, um, however it's just a triangle bikini. I really like this one, my only um, kind of negative about it is that the padding that they put in it, it's all the same size and the same shape for every bikini, they don't actually shape it to the bikini if you can see here, um, and it kind of shows through a little bit which is something that I'm not really too keen on. However, which is super sad, they have the same bottoms as the mustard yellow and it just digs in and looks rubbish. But, although I think they're, I don't think they're a different red, I'm just going to, the bikini that I mentioned at the start, the ones I really like the bottoms of, I'm just going to pair these together. When they're a little bit separated from your top to bottom, you're not going to notice. Next so. one is again a triangle bikini, um, has a different sort of clasp, the holes and you can like put it in at three different tightnesses I think. This one's orange, I don't own anything orange at all. The sizing's just a bit big, like it, it's not really great fitting, doesn't do too much. It has padding, which is nice, but it wouldn't be my first choice of bikini. And it's a really weird, shiny orange. I wish it was just matte, but it's not. It's kind of got a little bit of a shine and I don't really like it. This is the orange version. It's a bright orange, but it's like shiny or shimmery. I don't know. I don't really like that about it, but this one is pretty big as well. Um, the sizings are just so weird and the bottoms they are like the style that digs in a little bit but they're a little bit different they don't dig in as much and wouldn't be my first choice bottom so that one kind of wasn't great i then got a top which i thought i could wear as sort of like a beachy cover-up thing kind of got this layered like you know ruffle effect that's very in at the moment and it just ties in the middle and i thought this would be a gorgeous top i could wear it with jeans as well but very see-through, pretty rubbishy material and just doesn't tie up over my boobs very well. I've got it on with just a red bikini underneath. Um, it's this frilled, really weird material to be honest, um, just top. I really like it, like I like the idea of it. It's really see-through. It's a medium but I don't know whether it's like me or what but it, it just does not fit. So it would be nice to wear in an outfit like at the beach but Oh, I don't know, a bit of a fail, which is a shame because I really, really like this one on the website. This next one I didn't try on in a video purely for the fact that it's really rubbish fitting and honestly, like, there's not much to it. It doesn't cover much. This one did come with padding, but the padding misshaped it a lot, so I just took it out and it looks much better. It's essentially like a knot bikini, so the back is crisscrossed with a knot. You pull it over your head, um, there's a knot in the middle. On the website it looked amazing. It's really long, don't know if you can see, so like where your boob should sit here, if this is on your shoulder properly, it's not covering much. I really like the style, I thought it was a bit different and I like the yellow. The bottoms are okay actually, they are a thicker bottom so they don't dig in, um, they have knots on the side and I like these yellow bottoms so I think I could mix and match these bottoms with something else, something plain, maybe white um, would be nice, um, I think black would be a lot and you might like a bumblebee. I like the yellow and I like the not star, I just, again, not been made very well. We're now moving on to the last two, which are massive fails. Again, I didn't try this one on because it's flipping huge. Got a medium, as you all know now, crop top style. But this bit in the middle is so wide that your boobs don't really sit in these parts, they almost just 
are fully on show in the middle. <laughs> the blue did not look like anything like the blue on the website. Um, it's actually a pretty grim blue. Reminds me of like um, when you used to do dance and you used to have those like flared jazz pants. It's like that but blue. Not a fan. Maybe it would fit someone with smaller boobs better but I just can't fit in that. Bottoms are huge like that. They are like probably a size 12 or 14. <laughs> um, they just look massive and they are massive and again that the kind of long thing that goes really high waisted I'm just not really a fan of that so that one was a bit of a fail. The last one I'm annoyed is a fail because it was one of the bikinis I was actually really excited to get. It's this one which again is like a crop top style double strapped um, bikini really really nice very small like very small you'll see in the clip that I covered up because I it was very revealing pushed your boobs up a lot this one is the biggest fail by far I feel like I have to cover up because it's just so tight um, my chest I really like the double straps the designs are really nice the size is terrible it's so small I love the style of it I wish it was bigger it would look amazing the weird thing about it is that this when I ordered it was khaki I ordered a khaki bikini and I got this skin coloured nudie bikini and it's not even really a nice nude, it's kind of a yellowy skin colour, it's not great and it even says like on the packet, light khaki, medium, like it, it said that it was khaki but it's not khaki in any way. This is khaki, how is that even close? I've no idea. And again, the bottoms are these horrible high waisted thin diggy any sides so that really sucks because i wanted to love this bikini but i don't that is all the bikinis that i had to show you i got quite a lot and i really really enjoyed trying them on and trying different styles of bikinis because i think it's quite hard to um get a really really good fitting bikini i'm really petite and small i'm only 5'2 but um i do have a larger chest size so Oh, could this video get any more awkward? I do really like most of them and overall I don't think this video was that much of a fail. So yeah, go and check out their website. They're really, really affordable. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!